I'm super excited to share with you all the snake bean. This is the Chinese python that I got from Baker Creek. Now, I did try these same exact seeds last year, and they did not do well at all. Most of them did not germinate. The other ones were, like, diseased, and they never even got really plantable size. So, super disappointed in them. I think the seeds had a disease or something, but I don't know. So, I had a few seeds left over that I'm going to do today. Um, I have six seeds in this. This fruit tastes is like green beans and is the largest snake bean variety grown up to 60 inches long and one and a half inches thick. As it matures, it develops a bright green color and a thin layer of wax on the skin. Now, my um, some of my families from down in Kentucky, they called these uh, long beans, which are not long beans, or they called these bean gourds. They would slice and fry them. But the good part about these is they don't get diseases like other squash do. The squash vine borers don't get up in them. One inch thick, one inch deep, I mean, is how we're going to plant them. We're going to plant two pots. Look at that seed. Two pots with three in each pot. Let's hope that our bean gourds or snake beans do good. They're really delicious. And like I said, they don't get the squash buying boars and you can use these just like a summer squash. Y'all have a blessed day.